Hi there, my name is Dr. Dominic Rowley and I'm the Medical Director of Let's Get Checked. Um, I'm here today to talk to you about progesterone. What is progesterone? Well, progesterone is a hormone produced uh, in the ovaries. It has a number of functions, but one of its most important functions is to cause thickening of the lining of the womb or the endometrium to prepare the womb for a fertilized egg, i.e. to prepare the womb for a pregnancy. If the, if, if the egg is not fertilized, the endometrium breaks down and a period occurs. So why get your progesterone levels tested? So one of the main reasons that our, our female patients ask for their progesterone levels to be tested is because of fertility issues. They may be concerned because they have unusual periods, or they may be trying to conceive, or they may have had difficulty trying to conceive, or they may have a complicated gynecological history and want their progesterone levels checked. So who should get tested? Well, as I mentioned, any woman trying to conceive. So if you've been trying to, ha if you've been having unprotected sex for approximately six to twelve months without any success, um, also people who have complicated um, gynecological histories, for example, polycystic ovarian syndrome, or if you have a change in your in your bleeding, your menstrual cycles, or your periods, and you're concerned generally about your gynecological health, then we would recommend that you get your progesterone levels checked. When is it recommended that you get your progesterone levels checked? Well, your progesterone levels are best checked seven days before the onset of your menstrual cycle or your period. So for somebody who has a very regular cycle, i.e. every 28 days, we would recommend that you check your progesterone on day 21. So conversely, if you're not so regular, and for example, you have your periods every 35 days, we would then recommend that you get your progesterone done on day 28. So if you have any doubts or queries about that, because it can be a little bit confusing, please contact uh, Let's Get Checked and speak with one of our nurses and they'll, and they'll best advise you. What affects the reading of this test or the test results? So as I've spoken about, the test is best taken day 21. There are also some other factors that may affect the reading of this test. For example, if you're having your period, that will affect the reading of the test, the time of day the test is taken, if you're taking fertility medications such as clomiphene, and some other medications. But again, if you have any doubts or queries, um, please contact one of our nurses through Let's Get Checked and they'll best advise you.